welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love and thank you so much for joining me here for another episode. Today I'm going to teach you how to make a delicious berry flavored water kefir that kind of reminds me of a berry cider. It is so delicious and it is so nutritious. It's incredible for ensuring that you're restoring good gut bacteria into your body. Now 80% of our immune system is formulated in our gut which means we actually need to pay attention to it. So I actually got started on the whole probiotics kick um, back when I was actually trying to heal the last part of my acne. I don't know if, you know if you're new to the channel, I used to have acne. Hello. You can check the video out right here. Um, so I had a lot of redness left over from my acne. Um, I used to be sensitive to avocado, nuts and seeds. Um, and caffeine was another one as well. Whenever I would have like a green tea, I literally would feel like I've just snorted a line of coke. It was crazy. My head was spinning around and I was just like very rattled. So since taking kefir, which I have done, oh my gosh, over three years now on and off. I'm not always consistent, but I need to learn to get better. Um, I've noticed massive improvements within my body and I just feel amazing. Obviously this is needs to be incorporated with a holistic health point of view. You can check out all my other series on my playlist that will support what I'm talking about. But I'm all about you know doing the very best you can with the knowledge and understanding that you have at the time. So without further ado I want to show you how simple this fabulous recipe is. It's my favorite. My, my old favorite was my lemon and ginger one which got over like 20,000 views. It's still amazing, but the berries, oh, even better. I incorporated blackberries because they were on um, Dr. Gregor's list as a part of the Daily Dozen. He talks about blackberries in particular having the highest level of antioxidants um, when you measure it per unit. And you can find out more about blackberries on my How Not To Die series. Oh my gosh, it's just so amazing and it's tasty. It's not like, oh, it's good for you, so drink it. It's honest to God, super duper tasty. It takes no time at all. Um, I'm gonna show you step by step how to do it. I hope you enjoy. If you make it, please tag me on Instagram. You'll find me at all my social media at Melanie Kate Love. I would love to see what you've come up with and you know, what did you think about the taste? Because it's delicious. It is alcoholic. I just need to make a quick disclaimer about that. Yes, by having just a little bit, you will find the lightheadedness depending on the level of which you consume alcohol. I rarely drink, so I feel it a lot quicker. Um, but it's tasty. It's so tasty. And the color is so beautiful and vibrant. And it's kind of like the color of my shirt. Anyways, my love, I hope you enjoy. Remember, continue to make better choices. I'll see you soon.
there you have it, my loves. I hope you have enjoyed how to make this beautiful berry flavored kefir. It's so delicious and nutritious. I can't wait to see how you go when you make it for yourself. I just wanted to remind you, if you are new to the MK Love fam, make sure you subscribe videos every Tuesday and Sunday at 6 a.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. I make videos about delicious and nutritious food, self-love. I throw in a little bit of activism. I'm into minimalism. I talk about the Komari method and how it literally changed my life. I have a meditation series. I also throw in a little bit of oracle and tarot readings. Oh, I cover everything. That's why it's holistic health and wellness. Anyways, my love, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Click on the little bell so you are notified each time I post a video. Have an amazing day wherever you are in the world. And I will see you next episode. I love you so much. Bye.